Hi, so this will be the rock pro project for science um, by me, Abigail, and a little bit of help from my dad, who's on the camera. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> um, so we're going to start with our, um, uh, what was it called? It, igneous rocks, which just a little bit of these candles because they're pretty much dead. Um, and this candle, which we took the wick out of, for our igneous rocks. We will, um, use the cheese grater to make them into sediment. And the sediment will go into these cups. And, you, as you can see, you already have a bit. Um, then once we compress it, we will, um, melt it with... Wait, wait. What do we what have? Are we waiting? What do we have? Oh, sedimentary rock. You have sedimentary rock. Right. And then we will melt it with a little bit of glitter to represent the metamorphic rock. And then that metamorphic rock, once it cools down, will be melted to represent the magma and then poured out once again to represent the igneous rock. And it goes full cycle. I'm just going to start grading them now. Shouldn't take too long. Even more. Rotate it a little bit so you're scratching in a different spot. Again, I think that'll be enough, okay. considering the amount we already have. Okay, so that's our sediment. Yeah. Which is what? Tiny, um, tiny pieces. It, oh, tiny pieces of rocks and um, sometimes other organic matter, or actually, yeah, most times other organic matter. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we have that, and we're going to use the piece of paper to help funnel it. So there's your sediment. Yes. And then this sediment, well, with the help of the paper, will go to our very deep seabed. Well, now we need some pressure from the water. Oh, yeah. It's always... More is always coming in. Pressure from the water. Okay. We can always have more and pressure because there's always more sediment. Mm, I think that's good. Okay, and then we have some more pressure. appreciate it if you can also do it mm -hmm. just to try and get everything you got. Mm -hmm. Hold that. How do you do it? It's looking for something flat. Hold on. Make sure to look at our very awesome silverware drawer if you want to yeah, pay attention. Because that way I can put more pressure. <laughs> All the pressure you got. Because there's a lot of pressure down there. Yes, that's pretty pressured. Yep. And because of the friction, there is a bit of heat as well. Mm -hmm. Any more pressure, I think we'd be breaking our um, sediment. Yep. <laughs> more. I just want to make sure it's good. Alright. Okay. Um, You're going to have the camera now. Okay, let's try and... Warm it up just a bit. Um, Your job. Yep. So what we're going to do is we're going to put it in that hot water right there. You don't need to hold the camera. And what that should do is loosen up the wax that's stuck to the inside of the cup so we don't have a repeat. Just 
just a little bit though. I don't want the plastic melting. Plastic won't melt in boiling water. Okay. Uh, so right. just to soften it up, right? Yeah. Okay, let me check it. Yeah. yeah, that's not hot. Okay, turn it upside down and give it one good whack. Okay, yeah. now before picking it up. It's not down. Hold it. Up. We're going to tap the bottom. We might have pressed it too hard. There we go. Uh, not enough. No, we got... Okay, well, sedimentary rocks are very crumbly. Yeah. Okay, so now this is what? This is a... Sedimentary rock. Sedimentary rock. Uh, which is... Kind of. Very crumbly. <laughs> very. It's a soft sandstone. Yes, soft sandstone. Okay, now what happens next? Now we're going to melt it down with a bit of glitter, and um, it will represent the metamorphic rock. Okay, so what we're going to do gonna... is, let's tap the rest of this out of here. Yeah, I think we might have to fill it in again. Just yeah, scrape that. No. Okay. Here, now we're going to switch over. Put put your glitter in. Uh, I just got to put it in when we put it no, in. Just put some here, because I don't want you put, putting glitter in over the fire. So the glitter is just going to represent... Um, the, the change. change. Yeah. Okay, now you hold this and make sure you video what I'm doing. I'm going to put this in the heat so our sandstone. Very crumbly sandstone. Will almost immediately start melting. Look. So now, what do we have? If we. It's, um, um, it's turning it's, into... It's slowly turning into the... Is metamorphic. Me, me, metamorphic. Okay, so, so um, now give me my thingies. Thingies, yes. Your oven thingies or mm -hmm. whatever. Well, let me we'll remove this. Now, now we've got a little... Just a little bit. So what we've got is we got a little bit of melty. And a little bit of not so melty. Right. You know, we forgot a toothpick. Grab a toothpick. Uh, yeah, grab a toothpick. Sorry. It's fine. You can move the drawer open. I can't. Stool needs to rest against it. Toothpicks a little bit, but it'll be fine. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna mix it up just a bit because we put glitter in there. Yeah, it's, it's already right. starting it's to there. solidify a little bit. Okay, so we're gonna set that there. All right, so now here we have what is this again? Metamorphic. Metamorphic rock. A little melty on the outside. We got it a little too close to the heat. But there's our metamorphic rock, right? I'm going to see if I can poke it so we can bring it out and look at it. Oh, look, it's sparkly. <laughs> it's pretty. Okay, so there's our metamorphic rock. Let's see if we can get the camera to focus on it. I don't know, that's what I normally do. You just go in. Oh, there we go. And then it just works. Yeah, it's a sparkly metamorphic rock. Okay, now what happens is, is where is this going to go? Mm, back inside. And what's going to happen? We're going to melt it down to a magma, and then to represent um, the volcano erupting, the magma will come out of the pot, which you're going to imagine is the volcano, turn into lava, and then be poured into this little container or this pan. No, we'll oh. put it here because we're it not was... putting it on the paper. No, we're, oh, we're pour putting it in there. there. Yeah, we pour it in there to form the igneous rock once again, and, and that it. completes the so rock the cycle. Mag the magma will cool into an igneous rock, right? Yes. Mm. 
Yeah, that's starting to melt already. Mm. Please don't. Mm. Okay. Can you do the... I'm going to stir this around a little bit. I don't know if wood's the best option for that. No, oh, it's fine. It's well below the ignition point of wood. Boiling water is not nowhere near. Okay, it's almost completely magma. Almost. Are there holes in there? Doesn't look like it. No, those are just little dimples put in there for feet. Feet. Okay. So we now have magma. Indeed. Okay, so I'm, I'm going to lift this out when I'm here. Should I'm I gonna, get the camera? Yeah, I'm going to hand this to you, but first I'm going to turn the heat off. So you can watch. I only need one, I think. Put the other one there just in case. Now we grab our beautiful magma volcano. Well, it's a volcano, yes. Oh, and there's a glitter in it, too. Well, yeah, there was glitter in it when that happened. And then we pour it out into our brand new candle slash rock. It's actually a very pretty purple, purple color. Mm -hmm. With bits of glitter left over. Should from... we put the wick back in? Did you throw it out? No, yeah, we threw it out. Oh. It's fine. That would be cool if we made a completely new candle. Mm -hmm. Now, because that's all wax. wax that's held together like this, and it's um, very warm, it's going to take a little bit to solidify, but you can start to see the process. Look, right here. See how it's getting cloudy? Yeah. Okay. That means it's starting to solidify. The wax is crystallizing just like... Mm, the rocks. Right. Just like the rocks will crystallize and turn into... What is this turning into? It's turning into the igneous rock. The igneous rock. It looks really pretty. Mm -hmm. I wish we kept the wick. I don't know that burning glitter is a good idea. It wasn't burnt, it was melted alongside wax. Oh, but I'm saying if you put a wick in there and then you want to burn the candle. Oh, yeah. I see the glitter floating to the top, actually. Hmm. If you get at it from a certain angle. Now hmm. it's a shadow covering it, so you can't see the shine. Oh, wow. What? Can you see it Look on camera? Look at the camera, yeah. Oh, yeah, you can see it on camera. It's very pretty. Mm -hmm. What should we do with it? I don't know, but we gotta wait for that to fully cool, so why don't we sign off? Alright, this is Abigail and her co-host, who we're just gonna call Dad, signing out. Bye!